Check, check, check. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're checking out a really, really unique new map in Skater XL. Let me just turn around and show you guys what we're dealing with. Yeah, we're, we're, we're skating a tabletop. This is called Desktop Skate Park. Uh, this is by Sashko. So let's take a look around and I'll show you guys what we're dealing with. We got this large character model here, right? So you have this large character and you got a little miniature. Look at myself, look at my guy. <laughs> look, look at the size difference. On the TV up here, you got my buddy Skatebeard. It's another uh, Twitch streamer on Twitch. There's his little logo, Skatebeard. If you don't know who that is, give him a follow on Twitch. Hey. Black River Trucks. Like these are the official trucks I guess people use for like hardcore fingerboarding. You got a Skater XL ramp. That's pretty cool. Little bank. Got a Thrasher magazine over here for a side bank. You got some Lego ledges. Very, very cozy looking room though. Look at this. So. Let's get right into it. I want to do a few things and show you guys some cool stuff that you can do with this map, including what you can do with mods as well too. So if you have a PC and you have access to the Da Vinci mods and stuff, you can do some pretty, pretty cool stuff. So I'll whip up the XXL2 mod, okay? There should be an option to hide player. Yeah. And now you can really fingerboard. You can hide the player. You can actually cruise around like as if you were fingerboarding in Skater XL. And I can even drop down to the floor, skate down here, do whatever. It's hard to keep track if I'm switch or regular. You gotta pay attention to like, I guess, whatever direction you spin. I don't know if I can go underneath it. Oh. Yeah, you can't go underneath the, uh, the couch, apparently. But this is super cool. I want to make an edit like this. At the end of this video, there will be a skateboarding edit, but there won't be a skater. It's gonna be just a tech deck edit. But yeah, this is what we're doing today. I mean, it's pretty strange. That, uh, like, I'm, I get to push around like this. I can even push Mongo, you guys don't even know. I push Mongo this whole time. But yeah, this is the whole park. I think he's gonna be adding more stuff in the future. But what I wanna do is get down to getting some clips, and hopefully, at the end of this video, you guys will enjoy the montage that I have for you guys. So, let's do that, I guess. Can't see my, where my guy's standing, so I don't know, like, what. Okay, that was pretty sick. Turn back around over here. Uh. Oh, baby. <laughs> that was just so cool. Oh, and what's even sicker is like, I can like pull out my camera like this. I can put the camera right where the guy's face is and pretty much just follow my skateboard around. Huh. That is wild. I can't believe this. Wow, Nolly late flip. I guess you can't really tell what exactly I'm doing. Oh. Do a ghetto bird over this? <laughs> Promise. I trust trust me that was a ghetto bird. I tried. Didn't really turn out very good. Oh, Nolly big flip over that. Nolly big heel, sorry. Oh. Alright, let's get some lines, guys. Let's start filming clips for this edit. Right, Nolly flip no slide. I'm gonna do 180 manual. Oh, that was not a good line. That was pretty cool. All right, so let's capture this line, guys. Coming up. Oh, this is so cool looking, too. And you can film so close because it's just a little fingerboard. Nothing else to film. No head to chop out. The head's already chopped out, man. I'll just film it like this. That was pretty cool. Huh. All right, cool. Got that clip. Let's keep it rolling. Let's get some clips over top of this uh, thing right here, I guess. Like an only inward heel. That was kind of cool. That was a bit strange looking, like, honestly. All right, let's do like a backside double flip over this. Damn. All right, that looks pretty good. Let's just uh, cruise around, see what else we can do. Like, I mean, I can skate other things. Like, I can skate the floor. Not really much down here to skate. Like, I guess I can, like, spline that or something. Eight 
skate on the floor, man. Look at this. Got all this open space. Not much down there. So let's keep doing some stuff we got on this. Got a picnic table over here. Oh, that was pretty sick. Go three flip. Uh. That was really cool. I liked how this sound like kind of slowed down over time there. Oh, that was nice. Oh, I fell off the desk. Oh, it fell right off, dude. Oh, that was nice. Push back around. Damn, that would've been cool. Go for like a Nolly 180, like switch Suski, I guess. It'd be like a Nolly 180 crook or something. Yeah, that was pretty good. Can I make this corner? Oh, I almost fell off. Ah, that was sketchy. Right on. What else we got? Oh! Why can't I land this trick, guys? It's so tough. Oh! Woo. That took me forever, man. Holy crap, that was good. All right, here's this line, guys. Finally gonna capture this. Let's go. Damn, a little bit slower at the motion here. Not bad, that was pretty cool looking. Let's keep skating around, see what else we can do. Back tail on this, cruise. Let's go for a little cruise for a little bit, warm back up. 180 manuals, flip out. A couple objects to get stuck on a little bit. Just seeing this stuff too, like it really goes to show like how much Easy Day Studio put into the board control in this game. Like most of the controls that you do with the game, you're not really controlling the guy's feet. Uh, more or less than you're controlling the actual skateboard. It's cool to see it in action though. Oh, that was nice. Alright, let me just uh, skate around for a bit more here. Cruise around. Half cat flip over this. Damn. <laughs> Hard to keep track of what I'm doing still. Put a little line there. Oh! I figure what we could try out, since there isn't much to skate here, you can use the Da Vinci map editor mod. So I'm gonna press F5, and there are stuff I can spawn in. I'm gonna try one thing. A cameraman. I wonder if I can make like a, I can make like a small cameraman, or I think I can scale him. <laughs> I'm trying to make my cameraman bigger. I'm just making him wide and flat. <laughs> what the hell is this? Yeah, I probably can't do it. I don't know. I was trying to get a cameraman, make him really big, but I'm just making him really wide and weird looking. So let's get rid of this guy. I don't need him. A little pyramid rail, you know? That's pretty cool. A little picnic table. You actually put it down this thing. Not bad. I wonder if I can move objects with ape shit mode. Let me just try it really quick. Oh, look at that. Oh, look, it just spawned a smaller magazine. <laughs> Oh my god, a smaller TV! Got rid of that. What else can I do? This thing. Look, a little small baby couch! Oh yeah, like you got like a little bed up here too. Look at that, a little bed. This room's so cozy, man. It's crazy. Got a fan. I wonder if I could skate the fan. Dude! I can skate the fan! It's crazy! Damn! I'm gonna fall off make the gap from the fan to the bed oh that's a big ass gap oh damn dude whoa what the hell his arms are busting through his back what what kind of landing is this so here's that spline I'll have to turn it and line it up with this object here yeah that spline is in there so now I can click the button where is it hide and show spline so I'll click hide spline press f5 again and now this object should be grindable. 
Hell yeah. I don't know what the heck that is, but it's grindable. That wasn't too bad. Cool too. Slow 180 over this. Close blunt that. Not bad. Actually, let's get one more trick. Let's try to get a double grind on this rail here. Alright, here we go. Let's try this. Here we go. Oh, that was nice. Woo! Like that one. All right, guys. Well, at the end of this video, we're going to put back the montage that we got today. Hope you guys enjoy it. If you guys do like the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. That would really help me out a lot. If you guys want to come by the Twitch channel as well, too, I'm always streaming Skater XL, so give me a follow on Twitch and maybe you'll catch me next time I'm live. And yeah, other than that, guys, I will catch you in the next video. Peace.